Good morning and welcome to Money Wisdom, sponsored by Johnston Brunetti. I'm Jillian Andrews. We're teaching you smart ways to manage your money and joining us now with expert advice is Eric Hogarth, certified financial planner and senior partner at Johnston Brunetti. Eric, thanks for being here. Great to be here. Good morning. All right, it's never too early to plan for the future and today we're discussing long-term care plans and how to know if you need one. Our first bullet point answers this question. Most people will need some sort of long-term care so everyone should create a plan. Before we discuss, we have some st statistics. 70% of people will need long-term care in their lifetime and 15% of people turning 65 will spend more than two years in a nursing home. So it's definitely something people will need. It's on everyone's mind. Obviously, as you get older and then into retirement, it's more on your mind and you're running out of options. So the sooner you you know, address this and have a plan about it, the better you're going to feel about it because it is going to impact you one way or another. Sure, that's a great lead way to our next point we want to talk about here. We're going to break down the various options for handling long-term care. First is a traditional long-term care. What does this mean? Traditional plan is you pay for a long-term care premium. If you get sick, it's going to pay out a benefit to you. If you don't get sick and you just die, it's gone. It's, it's like your homeowner's insurance. We hope that our house doesn't burn down, but if we don't have a claim, was that money wasted? No, you have the peace of mind of having the coverage. So these are the traditional plans. They do go up in price a lot of the times, but they typically don't make sense to replace them. You should probably keep what you have. Okay, and another option is a life insurance plan with a long-term care rider. What does this mean? So, same thing. You're paying a premium here. If you get sick, it's going to pay out a claim to you. But if you die never having used the benefit, some of that money that you put into it goes to your heirs as a tax-free death benefit. So, as an additional option to it, and it typically costs more money. All right, option three is a hybrid annuity with long-term care coverage. Same thing in that it pays out a long-term care premium, um, uh, long-term care payment. Typically, you only pay once into this. So you put a big chunk of money into it all at once. Well, it could be smaller chunk, bigger chunk. It depends how much benefit you're trying to get. But you do have the option of then canceling the plan and getting all the money back if you're later on in life and I'm in great health and I'm not going to use it. So again, you have more options than a traditional plan, but it's also more expensive. Okay, and the last option we have is, suggestion is personal savings. This is the most common route that people go down, is you self-insure. I hope that doesn't happen. If it does happen, then I've got this money set aside and that's what I'm going to use to pay for this. Because long-term care is insurance, which means you have to qualify for it. You might go through this whole process only to then find out, well, I'm not a candidate to be able to get it. So the most important thing is to address this and to have a plan to give yourself some peace of mind because most people worry about this and agonize over it for like age 60 for the rest of their life. And it doesn't have to be that way. And there's even more options than the ones I just talked about. So get some input on it, get some advice and get more peace of mind. I'm sure maybe even a combination, one of the first three options with a plan, and then you obviously want to have personal savings on top of that. Also depends where you're going to live. Different parts of the state, and not really the state, different parts of the country have vastly different levels of care and costs of care. So that's a big factor too. Okay, wonderful. And for people interested in learning more, you have a book offer for our viewers. We do. It's specific to long-term care. It's absolutely free. You can get it at moneywisdomtv.com. I encourage you, everyone, to do so because it's a huge topic. It's people are living longer and longer. That's wonderful. That's great. But the likelihood you're going to need care goes up too. So again, moneywisdomtv.com. It's educational, totally free on long-term care. And I think it'll help a lot of people. All right. Wonderful. That will do it for this edition of Money Wisdom. Eric, thanks for being here as great always. Here. Thanks, Jillian. All right. Wonderful. For Connecticut's Morning Buzz, I'm Jillian Andrews. We'll see you next time.